Oh, hi. I didn't see you come in. Welcome to the Density and Buoyancy Lab. For this lab, you're going to use the instructions that start on page 14 of your lab guide. Now, in your science course, go to Unit 4.03 and download the lab report document. If you have trouble opening it, hold down the control key until the document opens. You'll use the data table in that lab report to record your data. Now, the question you're going to study for this lab is how are density and buoyancy related when objects float? Let's get started. For part A of the experiment, you're going to determine the density of each block. For this lab, you're going to need the following materials. Scissors, a pint-sized cardboard container, string, water, a 200 gram mass, a 5 newton 500 gram spring scale, a hardwood wooden block, a pine block, medium rubber bands, a metric ruler, a calculator, and the clear plastic box. Use the 200 gram mass to calibrate your spring scale. Place the 200 gram mass on the scale and then adjust the screw at the top of the scale so that the scale reads 200 grams. Next, you measure the mass of the wooden block, the pine block, and the ice cube to the nearest gram. Place a rubber band around the wooden block and pine block so you can hang them from the spring scale. When you're ready to use the ice cube, tear off the cardboard. Run the cube under water to loosen the cardboard if you need to. To keep it from melting too much, return the ice cube to the freezer when you're not using it during the procedure. Use the string frozen into the ice block to hang it from the spring scale. Record the mass of each object in your data table. Now, measure the length, width, and height of each object to a tenth of a centimeter. Record the values in your data table. Now find the volume of each object. Multiply the length by the width by the height to determine the volume. Round the volume to the nearest whole number and record it in the data table. Calculate the density of each object by dividing the mass of the object by its volume. In part B of the experiment, you will determine the buoyancy of each block. Fill the clear plastic box halfway with water. Place the hardwood block in the water and measure the side of the block that's floating in the water. Now this is a cube shape, so it's going to float crooked in the water. Straighten it out without pushing it into the water so you can measure it. Look at the block straight on at water level so you can measure how much of the block is under the water. Record that value in the data table. Repeat these steps for the pine block and the ice cube. Now analyze your results. Calculate the density of each object. Compare the densities to the percentages of the object under the water. How do your results compare with your hypothesis? Is there a relationship between the density of an object and the way that it floats? Explain what you think.